Hey there fellow Minecraftians, welcome to another texture pack showcase and this time I'm taking a look at the dollhouse texture pack which is a lovely 16x16 simplistic texture pack made by Steel Feathers who is a great artist and has already made quite a lot of texture packs for Minecraft. Now um, this is his first simplistic one and um, it looks pretty cool and like I said it's 16 times 16 so you don't need to patch your Minecraft with HD with the HD patcher but it is recommended so you can have um, custom animated water and stuff so um, yeah I do recommend that you do that um, and just look at this pink bed fuck yeah <laughs> but um, yeah it's rather cool so uh, let's just head upstairs and as you can see the paintings over there some have been done but uh, most haven't but for me that isn't such of a big deal um, let's open this up and you can see the GUI it's rather nice and uh, simplistic but lovely again the chest now actually go here to this chest and um, you see that uh, most items haven't been done um, actually I've got the diamond sword right here that is a lightsaber so that's pretty cool but um, yeah most items still have to be done but that's no big deal like I said before and um, let's just head outside like so and here is the water I talked about and that uh, looks pretty awesome nice I l really like this tone of blue it's nice and vivid and um, yeah you can see that it's a very cool simplistic texture pack and um, I, re I like these I really do and you can see the grass and stuff it looks rather amazing but let's just take one of the minecarts out of the chest and get on the rails like so and hit the button and off we go now um, here I've got the sandstone with some clay and the bricks now we're moving into the ores room right here where I've got the coal ore the iron ore the gold ore diamond ore, lapis lazuli ore and the redstone ore along with the iron block, gold block, diamond block and lapis lazuli block and uh, I also got some flowing lava behind there that um, looks pretty cool so let's just get back in my minecart and we'll check out the, how the nether looks and uh, I really like how this obsidian uh, looks it just looks amazing um, and that yellow stuff was the soul sand. Now we've got the TNT explosion and some cacti and the sound looks pretty cool as well. Now here are the pistons, the wools and over there some of these sound blocks thingies. <laughs> Thank you. And this is a redstone lamp by the way. Now here's my boat, but sadly it has sunk again due, due to this stupid ice that gets everywhere. Meh, whatever. Um, let's head this way where I've got the pumpkin, which is quite original so to say. And I'll actually break this one and put it on my head. But um, that hasn't changed. Now, I really like this as well, these are these hangers and such. I think that's quite creative. I haven't seen any anyone do that before. And um, yeah, pretty cool. And this is the lit up pumpkin jack-o'-lantern. So let's move on to the farming section where I've got some melons and some plants, some wheat and the sugar cane. Meh. Yeah, let's place that back, shall we? Right. Moving on to here. And um, I really love this. This looks great. The iron bars. And um, yeah, they, these just look amazing. I, I think they're one of the best I've ac ever seen, actually, for the iron bars. And here are the stone bricks, the cracked stone bricks, and the mossy stone bricks. And, some, and a pine tree as well. Moving on again with the cobblestone and mossy cobblestone. For the rest, I've got some mycelium here and a giant mushroom and another giant mushroom along with some cake nom nom now I'm going this way and here I've got the new jungle tree and then um, this pack is fully updated to minecraft 1.2.3 so that's great but um, let's go here and I've got a, another time the redstone lamp and it looks pretty cool as well 
Now here is the end stone brick thingy. Now actually it's stone, <laughs> but uh, whatever. The enchantment table, the brewing stand, the cauldron, and the nether bricks. Now here I've got some uh, bedrock, which is uh, very dark. And last but not least is the end portal. And uh, I'll just jump in here to show you how the end looks. And um, look at that blueness. I really have got no idea how he did that or where that com came from. But um, <laughs> I think it looks really amazing. I've got no idea how he, how he did that or if it's just a bug. I think not. But um, yeah, it looks rather amazing. Anyway, this is a really cool text pack, so uh, go check it out. I'll put the download link, or at least the link to the thread, actually, in the description. But um, for the rest, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.